junkfoodtaster.com and it is time for an interesting question. So if your favorite fast food restaurant is closed or something, <laughs> it's never closed, but anyway, it's closed. And what is better, to eat a pizza burger by Dr. Oetker or to eat a microwave burger from the Lidl? So, yeah, this is basically this episode all about. You may have heard about the pizza burger. It's basically pizza, uh, which you can put together then and have a burger. Yeah, it looks quite good. This uh, looks very much ready. Oh, and, and these are the, the packed, this is here, burger frozen food, uh, pizza burgers frozen foods. This is now just cold food. And yeah, this looks not so nice. They say here uh, microwave, they say microwave one minute, just one minute. <laughs> and here they say oven 13 minutes. Okay, let's do this. Okay, so welcome to my oven. <laughs> of course it's dirty. Never clean it. <laughs> means that it's always dirty. And yeah, pizza burger first, of course. Because it takes longer. Um, yeah, so here we go. Okay, so yeah, whilst the pizza burger is in the oven, I try to get this started here with the beef burger American. Is this American style? Just some cheese? I will put some sauce on anyways. But first of all, I'm trying this. And I guess it will get very crispy. So one minute is not a lot, so I'm using full power. Uh, yeah, I just let the camera roll, I think. Uh, yeah. Uh, so I can show you the sauces. I will use in a second. Okay, so here we go. Uh, Heinz, one of my favorite sauces, Heinz mango curry, curry mango, and it's like ketchup, say so it's seasoned ketchup, basically. Yeah. So 20 seconds are left. Go 16. Very <laughs> really exciting, isn't it? And it's done. And with these, I'm not that quite sure. I got steamy, all right. Um, can I touch the plate? This should be microwave uh, equipment. Okay, what, what, what happened to the top bun? Anyways. Can you hear the oven? <laughs> I'm eating it. Ah, it's still. So one minute is a lot. Here, sort of it heated up on the back. You can touch. It's steamy hot. Okay, so I think I wait 30 seconds or something. Okay, so it's cooled off, I think. And I have a bite <laughs> into this delicious looking thing. Okay. Um, it's not that bad. It's a lot of meat. And then my sauces. There we go. I put the mango sauce on. And check out whether this saves the day. I think for the bottom is a good idea. Here we go. Let's drop it. And yeah, let's try this. Check this out. Here we go. Okay. Um. Hmm. Yeah. I think with the curry mango sauce, everything tastes nice. Yeah. Good. Um. Yeah. There you go. I always cut. <laughs> I always cut up. Um. 
this would be the profile. Mango sauce, very big patty. Yeah, the beef taste is okay, not bad. And then cheese at the top. Okay. Um, nice. So, let's check out the other, the pizza burger. Okay, so here it goes, and this time we really have nice oven eggs. Let's get them. Uh, yeah. And also the, the meat stuff. It's a mixture between salami and ham. Okay. It smells kind of good. It smells. Um, this, is, this is like the seasoning. Yeah, can you see it? That's the seasoning. <laughs> I'm liking my grid. <laughs> only on my channel yeah and I get up to the studio again and we will check out the pizza burgers okay so before I go up I will put them together I think it's a good idea to put them together while they are still warm um, yeah. there we go. looks, looks kind of big okay all right so here we are and they cooled off they have now eating temperature um, yeah, kind of soft. <laughs> and this is a normal pizza door, pizza base stuff they use. And anyways, I want to cut. Oh, it's still dirty from my other cut, but anyways, I always cut stuff. And yeah, so this was a useless cut basically. Yeah, yeah, only on my channel. <laughs> I said this is the third time now, and I eat it. Here we go. Okay. Um, um, yeah. Tastes like a pizza. A pizza with a lot of dough. Um, very messy. Um, I spice it up with my mango curry. Use it. Mmm, ah, with the sauce, everything tastes better. It's a magical sauce. Heinz mango curry. I, I just recognized I didn't use my ketchup. So, <laughs> I'm putting on my fragment here, on this was, was, was left from the other burger, some ketchup on. So, not that I promised something and didn't keep my promise. And have now the mango sauce beef cheese burger. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I have to say, the microwave burger is a better burger. This is a pizza um, who thinks it's a burger, but it's not a burger. Yeah. It was good to have this comparison video. Um, I know whether uh, Dr. Edgar wants to go further in the direction of If you like pizzas, it's an interesting pizza. But if you want to have real burger feeling, then you have to take something like this. And here you, yeah, you get sort of a real 
as real as could get in a microwave basically the reef healing only on like real restaurant um i don't like the messiness of this uh, i don't i think i've rated the pit, pizza burger win in the past but i want to correct my rating i don't like it i rate this year the microwave burger the win and the pizza burger i give it a draw yeah. Um, it's too messy and it's too much a pizza yeah and remember if you eat I eat it like this here if you eat it now this is good like this without putting it together is different experience anyway that's it my friend and thanks for watching Okay, äh, jetzt geht es also um die Frage, was ist, wenn das Burger-Restaurant der Wahl geschlossen ist? Sollte ich lieber einen Pizza-Burger mir holen oder sollte ich lieber einen Beef-Burger essen? Das ist aus dem Lidl. Der ist hier nur noch in Teilen existent. Genau. Ähm, ja, also mein Urteil ist, äh, Mikrowellen-Burger noch eine Soße drauf machen, eine leckere Soße, zum Beispiel Heinz Mango Curry. Man hat viel Fleisch, ähm, sehr guter Rindfleischgeschmack, ist okay. Und bei dem Pizza Burger, ich habe, ich weiß gar nicht, wie ich den Pizza Burger früher bewertet habe, aber vielleicht habe ich damals noch als Innovation gesehen oder so. Ich muss ehrlich sagen, mir ist das viel zu breiig. Dieses S, dieses S-Gefühl vom Pizza Burger ist mir viel zu breiig. Und das ist mir viel zu pizzamäßig. Ziemlich salzig. Ja. Das ist eine Pizza zum Anfassen. Eigentlich, ja. Also ich komme mit dem Breigen überhaupt nicht mehr klar. Das macht mir überhaupt keinen Spaß, so einen breigen Stuff zu essen. Ich weiß mein auch nicht. Ich weiß nicht, wie ich es damals gewertet hatte, aber mir gefällt das Produkt nicht mehr. Äh, man kann es noch essen, also es ist raw. Es ist noch kein Fail. Aber ich würde mir lieber das hier kaufen. Okay, das wäre die Folge gewesen, wenn ihr es angeschaut habt. Und bis zur nächsten Folge.